Hello everyone. I hope you all are doing great. In today's video, I am going to show you how to add new library in Proteus 8 software. As we all know that Proteus doesn't have all the components in its database. So if you want to add new components in Proteus and want to use those components in your Proteus simulations, then you have to add their library first. The link of this tutorial is given in the description of this YouTube video and I have shared this complete procedure how to add new library in Proteus 8. On our blog, we have posted many new Proteus libraries for engineering students and I would suggest you to download those libraries. So let's get started with how to add new library in Proteus 8. First of all, download any Proteus library from our site and here I'm using this vibration sensor library. So I'm gonna download it. Here's the library folder and here we have our vibration sensor library files and I'm gonna extract these files in the library folder of my Proteus software and the library folder is found in C drive so I have to click this C windows and in this C drive you have to go either in program files x86 or in program files folder if you have installed 64-bit Proteus software then your Proteus will be installed in this program files folder but if you have installed 32-bit Proteus software then it will be installed in this second folder Proteus files x86 and as I have installed 32-bit that's why my Proteus software is present in this program files x86 folder and in this folder I'm gonna search for lab center electronics here it is proteus automatically creates this folder lab center electronics and now in this folder i have both proteus 7 and 8 i have installed both of these software that's why i have these in my lab center electronics and i'm gonna install these three libraries in the proteus 8 professional so i'm gonna tick this and in this folder we have to find library folder which is present here so now I'm gonna place all these three files all these three library files of vibration sensor in the library folder of my Proteus 8 software and I'm gonna click OK as I already have these files in this folder that's why it's asking for so I have to click yes to all and now I have placed all these vibration sensor files in my Proteus 8 software and similarly if you want to place these files in Proteus 7 then again we have to go here C Proteus files x86 and then we have lab center here after that Proteus 7 professional and here we have this library folder and I'm gonna click OK and in the same way we have placed all these three files in the Proteus 7 professional now I'm gonna open my Proteus 8 software and uh, we are gonna create a new project Now in the components mode, we have to search for our vibration sensor and here it is vibration SW420 and here is its model. Now you can quite easily use this vibration sensor in your Proteus 8 software. So that's how you can quite easily add any component library in your Proteus 8 professional. Now let's have a look at Proteus 7 and here as well we have to search for our vibration sensor and here it is vibration sensor SW420. So we have successfully added our vibration sensor library in both Proteus 7 and Proteus 8. I hope this video will help you. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.